this. Uh, this is a normal view in Sweden around this time of year. It's never, never really dark. And I'm on my way to London. Join me, it's gonna be very, very exciting. Let me explain what is happening. So I was invited to come to London to record the, like, the backstage and the vlog for Martin, who is a Polish entrepreneur, who is publishing Gary Vaynerchuk's books in Poland. So he's gonna interview Gary and he wants me to record some stuff over there. Here I go. Under and every mini setback is the fire under me, Carmen and Juni's jetpack. So I use that for fuel and I combine it with confidence, which is hard to find for me. I'm digging for substance. So if you know somebody who could use a helping hand, just tell them what I tell myself. Look at your hands and understand. London, baby. You're amazing, you're amazing. You're and this is Martin who invited me here. <laughs> I'm trying to get in Poland, came from Sweden. Hello, Mr. Bronianek. Exactly. Hello, good to see you. So we are at Viner Media London right now. We like just met Gary Vinerchuk who went for some meeting and we have like 40 more minutes before our interview with Gary. Marcin is uh, getting ready and I'm just trying to capture the moment. Very excited, very, very excited. You know this feeling like uh, you saw somebody so many times online yeah, like YouTube and videos and so on like you feel like you know that person but in real life you're just a fan of that person you never you never met that person that person had no idea about your existence and like suddenly here like on the corridor you meet that person you see first time in real life Gary that's huge for me that's huge hmm? Keep away from existentialism, drowning in thought. Drowning. Hey, nice to meet you. What else? Such a pleasure. How are you? Great. He's covered in ice, wearing nothing but socks. Can you explain the time of the one time? Awesome. Pleasure. Good to see you. Four or five times? Each yeah. time we publish Polish book of Gary Vee, yes. we're talking. It's very amazing time for us. That's your book? Thank you very much. You're welcome. You got it. Gary, can you sign the books, please? You got it. And just with the books, right? It was very fast, like uh, we were supposed to have an interview there in this conference room but Gary came, there was a chaos, the conference room, conference room was uh, occupied so we just sat Gary here on the couch, there was an interview, I think it was fine, pretty spontaneous, 30 minutes, he's gone and uh, I was quick, was, I was quick, yeah. Uh, great conversation with D-Rock though, great conversation with D-Rock, I love the guy, uh -huh. so I'll try to explain more later on. So there is, a, it's already Friday, there is one day after we met Gary, we are still in London, Hyde Park right now, very beautiful place, I was expecting rain, bad weather, it's very lovely London, very lovely. So, all the guys left, they're already on the way to the airport. I have around two hours to go to the train station, to go to the airport and go back to Stockholm. So, two hours to see some Lambda. Genuine font, susceptible to a John. I know I've never been here before, but it's all that I want. And I know everything that's led me up to this could be flaunted, but I'm... So, what's the plan? I'm gonna go and see the Buckingham Palace and then I wanna see the big band but I know it's renovated, being renovated so it's not gonna be fun and then uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. 
and yeah I have no idea how to do about the tickets or something but uh, oh well let's go with the flow is it possible to buy the ticket here or what do I do so that was a failure where can I get a ticket thank you so I can't buy the ticket on the bus in London lesson number one we still have two hours let's do that so there was a very very nice guy who helped me um, uh, apparently in London you can just uh, like click your your like touchless card like normal bank card and you can enter to the subway uh, I'm going to another station where I have a direct train but I won't stop till it rings. I do not balk at shots, no matter how hard it stings. But it's oh, it's e hmm. I'm trying to do that, and it's not working. I broke everything. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> um, just one second. I'll just try and repeat. I really tried to do it nice, but. Apparently I broke everything. Okay, apparently Revolut card can't be used in London transport system. I had to use my Polish credit card. Not good Revolut, not good. I still love Revolut, really. Awesome thing. Just not in London, not for transport. Okay, time is clicking and I did something wrong. Turned out I was in the wrong train. Now I'm changing. London, please don't make it harder than it is. I'm pretty sure now we're good. I'm pretty sure. You with the shit stained pants, trying to move to the top, trying to get into romance. Let me tell you something, buddy, have a grand old time. Sisyphus is laughing at you while he counts his dime. You can tell yourself you don't care, but you really do. And yeah, it's nice you care about it, but that's not really you. Who's okay, 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 okay. I got it, I got it. I'm here. There is a Buckingham Palace, like, uh, like behind there, behind this uh, roundabout. And I have one hour and 25 minutes to catch the train from the Liverpool station, which is somewhere else. But according to Google Maps, I can walk for 26 minutes to get to Big Ben and I will pass close to Buckingham Palace and I will see this like London Eye and I will see everything, I will see London. 30 minutes, walk, then go to the station, go home. Regular jock because I think what I'm bringing is something really special and I lead from the front something not easily read through but I don't come from all the people I'm not bred through it's just those who were there for me the reason I'm led through every mistake and blunder and every mini setback is the fire under me Carmen and Juni's jetpack so I use that for fuel and I combine it with confidence which is hard to find for me I'm digging for substance so if you know somebody who could use a helping hand just tell them what I tell myself look at your hands and understand the truth so, this thing behind me, it's a Buckingham Palace and me, myself, I really underestimated the London's weather, it's really hot. So, we have one hour and two minutes to get to the train station and we have ten minutes walking to Big Ben, which is being renovated, but still I want to go there and then, oh well. Like, I did my best to see how much I can. This is laughing at you while he counts his dime. You can tell yourself you don't care, but you really do. And yeah, it's nice you care about it, but that's not really you. Who's in there? You can feel really bruised, and that's fair, because you've been, because you've been. It's very lovely, London. Very lovely. You're amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a. You're amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a. You're a amazing, you're a amazing, you're a. In a way, London reminds me of Madrid with this um, very chill atmosphere in the park surrounded with a really beautiful architecture. Just like this one. You're amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a you're amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a you're a amazing, you're a amazing, you're a uh 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 amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a you're amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing, you're a Amazing, you're amazing, you're amazing. Yeah, so the majority.
majestic symbol of London, the thing that you can see on every picture, every postcard from here, and it's fully covered when I'm here. Too bad, too bad. And the status is like that, I have 25 minutes to get to the train station. Um, the, uh, the train leaves every 15 minutes, so it's not so bad even if I don't make it in 25 minutes. I'm gonna go there, I wanna see the London Circle, London, London Eye, London Circle. This, you know. Oh, yes. So I can officially say London checked. And now time to go for the subway, train, airport, home. It was a great stay. Great stay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Martin, for this possibility. Thank you, Gary. Thank you, D-Rock. Thank you, Michael from Mind's Finest. It was awesome. So there is a serious question. How me or you or anybody can meet anybody in the world who you follow or, um, or observe in the internet? There is a great theory that you can meet anybody in the world by connections. So I know you and you know that person and that person knows that person. And I think that it's five connections or something like that and you can reach anybody. Whether you want Pope or Obama or Victoria's Secret model or Gary Vaynerchuk. So in my case I needed two connections which is me and Martin and then Martin and Gary. And I'm pretty sure that we are really able to reach anybody in the world by connections like that. Yeah, but you need to mind the gap. So it's not enough that you know somebody that knows somebody. You need to mind the gap. So it's not enough that you will text somebody and say connecting with somebody. It's really hard to provide enough value for that person to make it possible for you to meet the other person. So in my case, it's um, providing video value for Martin. Apparently, it's good enough for him to decide to fly me from Stockholm to London to record for him the videos with Gary, the whole vlog. And if you provide enough value for people like that, you can get to anybody in the world. I'm pretty sure about that.